Hi everyone! So now we're going to learn how to find the union or intersection of intervals or the set of numbers. So let's say we have A, the set of numbers between 1 until 7. X is the element of integers and B are these set of numbers. So if you have A union B, we're going to write A between 1 but not includes 1 because we don't have the equal sign underneath the inequality. So we're going to start with 2 until 6 not include 7. Alright. And then B B are these set of numbers and we are going to take all of these numbers because of the union. So the answer will be like this in the curly bracket. 1 by 1. We have to write the numbers one by one. Now, question B, if we want to find the intersection, alright, the intersection, since C is the element of real numbers, alright, so we're going to draw a number line, draw a number line, okay, for 1 until 5, that is open interval. So this will be empty circle, empty circle. Then the intersection is only here we have 2, alright, and then 4. So the answer will be 2 and 4. Okay, with the curly bracket. For the next question C, we have C intersection D, which C X is the element of R. R is real numbers. Alright, so we're going to write on a number line where C is open interval 1 until 5. And then D negative 1 until 3. 3 is dense circle because it's included. So the intersection will be this here. Alright. So we will have from 1 to 3. Alright. So 1 until 3 that will be half open. For D, we have C union D. Alright, since we already have the number line, so we have to find the union of both intervals. We're going to take all of this, alright, from negative 1 until 5 for the union. And then only we do the intersection with the set numbers in B. So, what are the numbers that is actually intersect with C union D. Uh, so we have 0, 2 and 4. The intersection will be these numbers in curly bracket. Right? Thank you.